I'm so tired today. Hey guys, today is going to be a kind of an exciting day, or at least tonight will be actually, which is why I want to vlog today. I just finished doing my makeup because I have to film a video and hopefully edit it before I go out tonight because tonight I'm actually going to an event for Kiehl's. Tegan and Sarah are doing a private concert with Kiehl's because they have a foundation that they work together with and they invited a bunch of like beauty influencers, so I'm really excited for it. They're doing a meet and greet as well right before the concert concert starts so I'm hoping to vlog that part. Jessie's coming with me, Michaela will be there with her boyfriend I believe and then hopefully a couple other beauty bloggers and vloggers that I know that live in the area so I'm very excited to see everybody. I'm obviously vlogging in my bathroom because I need to do my hair before I start filming my video and I also wanted to show you guys that my shower is done. I have to turn on the fan so that the light comes on in the shower so you guys can actually see it but it's so beautiful. My dad did an amazing job. It looks so good. I love this shower head too. The door is also new too. It's really cool like how it opens but it has like such a sleek design now. It's way better than what the shower used to look like. And all of this is new too. I just bought this mirror pretty recently from HomeSense and then this is from Ikea and I got this rug from Target and I'm just really, really happy with how it looks. I do need to organize everything and then take all this stuff off of the counter, but yeah, I love it. But yeah, anyways, I need to start doing my hair. I just finished filming. It is 4.31. I should have been done with this part like literally an hour and a half ago. It took me well over an hour just to film something that should have taken like 25 minutes, but I kept messing up my words. Then somebody called and I came back and completely forgot where I was, so I had to start over. And then somebody came to the door after I had just started filming again, so I had to talk to them for a little while and then I came back and totally forgot where I left off, so I had to start over that whole like little section again. So it's just taken me way too long to do this, which means that I haven't had time to do the two videos that I wanted to film today, so there won't be a main channel video this week, I guess, but that's totally okay. Sometimes that just happens. I wanted to leave my house at 4.45 to go get dinner before the Tegan and Sarah concert, but I don't think that's gonna happen either. I'm still waiting for Jesse to get back and I have all of my filming equipment still up in my room. My room is also a mess. I don't even want to show you the other side. It's so bad. But it's mostly because my shower was getting renovated and I didn't have any room to put all the stuff that usually goes in my bathroom, but I will also need to work on that this week. <laughs> and honestly, I really don't want to put all of my stuff away right now. I'm so tired and I have so much to do. Why is there like... I have yams on my camera. That's gross. Okay, I'm gonna take down all of my filming equipment and figure out what to wear and then we'll see you guys after. My hair is caught on the button of my shirt. I need help. Honestly, the way that today is going, I probably like shouldn't leave my house. Oh my God, Jesse's home, maybe he can help me. My shirt's caught in my button. It's like, can I cut it? My hair? Yeah. No. <laughs> it's like, I don't even know how to get it off. It's just completely wrapped around the button. <laughs> Hi, Luna. I guess that little bit was. It might be coming out. No, just cut it. <laughs> Thanks. So I think this is what I'm gonna wear. I have like a flared sleeve shirt on, or it's a bodysuit and then some high-waisted, distressed, like, mom slash boyfriend jeans and this belt. And I think I'm gonna wear these booties with it. My bed is a total mess. I just threw everything on there while I was filming. <laughs> so we're here, waiting in line. And guess who's also here? Hello. And I'm gonna cut <laughs> Jesse's face off because he's too tall for us. <laughs> hey, how's it going, guys? Good. Are you guys excited? Yeah. 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 We're ready any second now. There's 
pop what do I want? Oh, there's even mini donuts. So we just met Tegan and Sarah. We got some pictures. They got some cute pictures. <laughs> Jesse was uh, holding my thing. So thank you very much for doing that. <laughs> yeah, it was cool. They were really, really nice. And we got like professional pictures done with them. I think that we get them back tomorrow. So hopefully at least one turned out okay. I'm pretty sure I blinked in at least like three of them. So. Tegan has done to you. <laughs> Signed, Julia. Well, tonight comes up as one. It's not her fault. It's not her fault that she got sick and I had to just on the fly come up with different her Just step back. <laughs> Whoa. Um, the next one's for me too, that's all. Oh, yeah, just crazy. Um, no, okay, the truth is, here's a, here's a diplomatic answer. Uh, I wouldn't say that Tegan annoys me. I think that, you know, there are just certain human uh, behaviors and characteristics that don't, you know, jive with me. I don't like people who are messy. And uh, Tegan is not that way, but um, sometimes when I feel she invades my space, whether it's uh, psychically or with her energy or uh, just her hand waving into my zone, um, that's annoying. Okay, we live our lives. We, we know a lot of interesting people and we travel and we read. Sarah lives for her cats. I live for my cats inspire me, you know. Actually, I know you're going to think this is an insane thing to say, but I've learned a lot about love and... Oh my god. I've, I've learned a lot from my cats. I have. Three, two, one. Wait, This is not a good place to be vlogging. We're walking back from the Tegan and Sarah and Kiehl's event that we just went to. It was really cool. They were actually like really funny and so nice and I got some pictures. But I wanted to vlog this because this place is really interesting. Yeah. Basically, you can just look at the back wall here. It's only like a few feet and this was at one point the skinniest building in the world. Yeah. You can tell like that's probably what like four feet, four and a half feet and that's the entire building. Yep. That's crazy. This was in Chinatown. And these floors outside are cool. My battery died actually on the way back, but we are home now. It was really fun. It was really cool actually getting to meet them. Hopefully by the time that I edit this vlog, I will have the pictures that I got to take with Tegan and Sarah so that I could show you guys what they turned out like. And I'm really hoping that I didn't like blink or make really weird faces, but yeah. I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.